because I've heard their name, said their name mentioned multiple times for the lunchroom banner. That's going to an even number class. I heard something. <gasps> Raise your hand if you think it's your class, if you're an even number. Even number. Okay, look, you're second grade, fourth grade. It is a fourth grade class, and it is Miss Elder's class. Congratulations to Miss Elder's class. Husky cheer for them. All right, and now the attendance banner. And we had several classes last week that had great attendance, but there's one that just totally rocked it out. And we actually did last Monday and Tuesday and the whole week before. And they did an amazing job of making sure, I'm sure, that they were washing their hands and that they were here and ready to learn on time and ready to go. And that goes to our smallest friends in the building. So who, what class could that be from? You're right. And that goes to Miss Henderson's class. So, uh, I love their excitement. Everybody see their excitement? They're like, yes, it does. All right, so Husky cheer for Miss Henderson's class. I love that. Guys, you all just made my day. I love to be in their excitement for earning a banner. All right, one more thing that I have to do, and then I'm going to turn it over to some student leaders, and that's our focus class of the week. You know, this class, I was really impressed because first day back yesterday, they were working hard. They were doing something that you would think that a third, fourth, or fifth grade class would be doing. They were in the computer lab. I think this class may already know who they are. They were in the computer lab. They were working on a topic sentence. Have you heard a topic sentence before? Not, oh. Raise your hand if you've heard about a topic sentence before in your writing. Yeah, I know all of this group especially should have their hands up. So they had to kind of put a little detail with their topic sentence. They had to kind of tell a little bit about it. And then they went and found a picture on the internet to match their sentence. They already know who they are. I can see more going, And that's going to go to Ms. Janowski's class. So husky cheer to Ms. Janowski's class. Emerson didn't even, she didn't even wait for me to say um, whose class it was. She was already on her way up here, so that's awesome. They were, I was very impressed because that was, they were actually typing, guys. They were typing. First graders were typing a sentence. It was very impressive. And they, they had great sentences. It wasn't so much that they were typing it. It's what they had was, was great work. All right, we've got a couple of student leaders to share with us, so let's listen to what they have to say. You told me a little yesterday, but I'm still not getting it. What are you not getting? I heard there were jobs. What jobs? Jobs are audience readers, welcome. Whoa, slow down a little. Take it one at a time. Okay, audio gets Christian music for students to enter to. Greeter makes people feel welcome and connected. Then there's warm up. They provide icebreakers, cakes, and anything to get people excited. Welcome sounds like too. They give opening announcements and sometimes give scripture. Workout introduces the teacher to make sure they can be there. Warm up, warm the rules. They close our meeting in prayer. They also do the final announcements and reminders. They have special events like games and fun projects. Wait, there's one you didn't mention. I can't remember what it was. Can you tell me? You must be talking about the additional rules where you make up a rule. Like any like any rule? You want it and it's a real rule? No, no, no. A role that is needed. And so then, we don't need to make sure that it's okay to our FCA made up mascot to show our pride and poster people to make posters for the mascot or to put around the school. Wow, I feel smarter already. Thanks for helping me. You're very welcome. All right, so girls, can you tell them again when FCA is going to meet? December 7th in the music room from 7.10 to 7.30 a.m. So third, fourth, and fifth graders, that announcement is for you all. All right, I think we're ready to get our day started. You all are doing a great job showing you are here and ready to learn. So here we go. Please 
to the tree. I will begin each day with a smile and a positive attitude. I will follow the 